Did you hear that? I'm not sure if I did either, but you're standing in front of one of the most haunted buildings in Austin, Texas, the Driscoll Hotel. I think I'm getting some goosebumps. OK, well, maybe not, but this hotel does have quite a history. Legend has it that the original owner, Colonel Driscoll, loves this hotel so much that he just can't seem to leave it. Some say they can still smell his cigar smoke in the lobby from time to time. I guess he doesn't know that Austin has changed to a smoke-free city. But by all means, go inside. You may want to walk up to the grand staircase while you're visiting. If you do, listen closely. If you hear a bouncing ball or other childlike noises, it could be the daughter of a former senator who fell down the staircase to her death while chasing her ball. Recent guests have stated that they've seen objects moving or lights turning off and on on their own. In fact, singer Annie Lennox even stated that while she was staying in the Driscoll, one of her dresses mysteriously moved from the bed to the closet. So what do you think? Are these urban legends or are they true? Well, I guess there's only one way to find out. Although I don't think I'm brave enough, are you? You may want to hear a little bit more about the history of the hotel or walk around for a bit. And when you're ready, continue down 6th Street to Congress Avenue. Turn to your right, and you will see the Littlefield Building on the north side of 6th.